Hey guys, and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Today I'm going to give you a walkthrough on how to do the Anomaly Parkour in Snottinghamshire, located right over here. So, towards the upper end of your map, in the middle of Snottinghamshire, which is right over here by Brian Dunn Hill. So make your way up the spiral staircase to kind of start on your parkour course to get to the colorful blocks. Once you get up here, you'll notice that all you have to do is jump to this section over here where you get to move this thing. You're going to be moving it all the way to the right side so that it basically lights up the section over there that's that's like grayed out so we're gonna move it all the way here so you can see it lights it up here and then we're gonna jump back to the section over here to the first laser beam that you will encounter and we'll be pointing this right over here so this is the first time at least I've dealt with the laser beams where it like shoots and then it turns off and then it shoots and then it turns off so you will have to time your runs. so that means wait wait for it so it goes off look see off it's gone if you're on there you're gonna fall to your death or like your checkpoint so as soon as it lights up again jump onto it and speed your way across because this one is quite a longish one so you need to time it so as soon as it appears you do jump and make sure you climb as fast as possible to get off of it because it will disappear shortly after you've gotten off the second part of this parkour is a little bit tricky, so we're going to take this kind of um, like movable thing object again, and we're going to move it all the way over here to this side, where you see there's two lasers on the other side that we need to get access to. You need to bring this thing over here so that the laser shoots at it, so it lights up this platform. Again, time it so that you have it like just as it appears, you jump on it because it does disappear really quickly. You saw it like disappeared. I had to fall a few times. You probably will fall as well. You have to time it so well, it's just insane. From here, you're going to take this laser and you're going to point it at the floor of the location there on the left over there. So point it there, take this thing back to that location where you originally found it, so it's right in the front top right corner here, so that the laser shoots into it. Now this means that you can basically walk across this thing without having to like fall, which is great because falling sucks. From here you're gonna grab this laser and you're gonna point it at that thing right at the back there, and now we're gonna basically go run to that thing at the back there. You're all done here. Trust me, this is all you have to do. I thought you had to do a lot more. It was so, uh, yeah, it's been like another five minutes there trying to figure out what I need to do, but Nope, that was it. Jump here, over here, and literally then time your climb. This one is a bit more lenient. You do have a lot of time with it. See, I even started halfway through here, and you can still lean over and jump onto this platform here. I think I just made it there. And then you can climb on the blue. Blue obviously is safe. You're not going to fall through it. And this brings us to our kind of like third section of this parkour area. So first, we're going to jump over onto this flat section right over here. Don't worry, it's not going to disappear. So you can jump across safely and make it to the other side. There's two lasers here. What you're going to do with these lasers is obviously move them and point them at these two objects behind you or in front of you technically in the direction that you're going so at this one so point one there and then you're going to point the other one at the other platform that's not showing up over here at this one over there so now you're going to climb up there to do some laser work up there and that will give you your you know, kind of you know access to finish the whole parkour for this little challenge so wait for it again to disappear and then as soon as it reappears run and jump because obviously if you're going to keep falling and starting from checkpoints kind of sucks run jump through i literally made it there nice Nicely. And this one here is quite a simple one as well. You'll see the wall here. Wait for it to disappear. As soon as it reappears, climb to the top of the wall and then use it to jump onto this blue section over here where we'll be moving this thing for the like seventh time or sec third time actually in this little challenge here. Now you're going to have to aim it at that kind of like grayed out section right at the back of the entrance there you can see right at the back it has to aim it there but you also have to give it access to the lasers here so make sure you move it in the way of the lasers here that turn on and off uh, a little bit backwards and then it lights up that beam right at the back there so now you can actually head all the way back but first you obviously had to head to these two lasers to bring them back onto this object here so that you can actually climb there so do these two lasers you need both of them so point both of them at this object over here because it will give you enough time to actually get across by making it permanent because one one laser beam is not enough to cross using this thing here from here you can climb this one directly there is no timer on this one i believe or it has a really long timer you can climb onto this pole here wait for this one to disappear as soon as it reappears, jump again because it is a timed one. Make your way over to the next one. The next one here has the exact same thing, so jump on as soon as it appears and then move on to the blue to be safe as possible. And that is pretty much the end of the course. It's pretty easy from here. You literally just run the rest of the kind of rows and I hope you guys enjoyed this walkthrough tutorial of this anomaly parkour in Snottinghamshire. And I'll see you guys in a future video. I hope you guys enjoyed and thank you so much for watching.